is this? You know, um, I'm channeling my inner Beyonce today. Really? Inner 70s inspired disco queen, you know? I got it. <laughs> so tell me, what made you decide to choose this outfit instead of like a gown? You know, it's because it's very Mamma Mia. It has the bell bottoms. Um, yeah, it's, it's danceable. Okay. <laughs> Can I hear just a little bit say, Mamma Mia? Mamma Mia, here we go again. All right, here we go with, with Jules. So, Jules, tell us, what brings you back to East Coast Players? You, you performed a few times. Uh, what always brings you back? I love East West Players, honestly, because it's representing Asian Americans. I'm always super proud to be Filipino American, and um, this musical is just a dream because it's a musical I never thought I'd be a part of, but um, it's an all Asian cast, and it's just amazing. So I always come back. Your part, your part in the cast isn't AJ Raphael in the cast too. Is that crazy to see one of the guys that was really big when YouTube first started? That made YouTube. You know? Yeah, it's amazing. I mean, AJ is one of my good friends. We actually just wrote a song together when we were rehearsing for Mamma Mia. So it's crazy. We were auditioning together and then we were rehearsing for auditions and then we ended up writing a song together. So it's now out on iTunes. Um, but it's amazing getting to work with friends. And um, now I'm in that whole YouTube world, the whole social media world. So it's very cool seeing that crossover. Yeah. And we've seen you grow from from the beginning and all that good stuff. But since you did a collab with AJ, would you both ever collab and try to write a Filipino song? That would be amazing. I am so down to write a Filipino song with AJ. You have to have to ask him. <laughs> but um, I'm definitely down. Yeah, we we're, we're both so so proud to be Filipino American. So okay, I'm gonna challenge you with the, your Filipino list. Do you oh, no. know? <laughs> Do do you know any Filipino songs or any Filipino music artists? So um, I actually sang with Jose Mari Chan, so I know all of his songs. But I sang "Please Be Careful with My Heart." Does that count? Yeah, that counts. If you love me like you tell me, please be careful with my heart. See, you're breaking my heart now. <laughs> there it is. There it is. <laughs> so, if you could choose a Filipino artist to sing with. Who would it be? Would it be like Sharon Kaneta, Gary V, or would it be JR? He's a prince of prince of R and B. Okay, I would say I would say Leia. I would love to sing with Leia. She's amazing, and I would love to meet her. A lot of people say that we sound similar, so it'd be cool to like do a duet. She'd be like my ate or something. <laughs> Tell us a little bit more of what's going on with you. Any any projects that you have or any any upcoming singles? Yeah, so I'm working on um, my first R&B album. Um, it's almost done, so I'm, I'm writing one more song um, this month. But right now I have six songs done. Um, I just had a song come out with AJ, Letting You Go. And um, I'm really excited to put out my next project. It'll be my second project as an independent artist. So and Make sure to tell everybody where to follow you. You can follow me at Jules Aurora on on everything, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. See you there. <laughs> She's the aura of Aurora. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.